the beat now spiritualized electric mainliner back with a new album their first for two years it's called pure phase jason pierce welcome to the program all right let's talk about the album what did you um try to achieve with this one i think we uh refined a lot of what we'd done with the last album laser guided melodies and kind of um got into making very pure sound very kind of where where with the last album we layered up a lot of sounds to get the same kind of emotive um, maximum effect. With this one, we kind of tried to, to get the same effect with fewer, um, fewer notes played and kind of got into the idea that we'd rather listen to one person playing one sound beautifully than have to layer up loads of sounds to get the same effect. I don't think it's a radical change from what we do, but I kind of I uh, think the bands that come back and say, hey, look, we've changed, this is the new us, this is our new style or whatever, kind of, they kind of belittle what they did in the past. Uh, I think the roots of what we do have, all, have always been the same and we've always been um, influenced by the same kind of stuff. And I, I think this album is, is just, a, I, I think it's, um, I think it's superior to Lazy Guided Melodies, but, not, but I don't think it, um, I don't think it's easy to compare the two. Mm. Why did you sort of arrive upon pure phase? Uh, I think because because of what I just said about after, um, achieving a kind of purity of sound, and I think that just relates to the, the kind of thing we're going, the kind of music we're into at the moment, and into performing. As does electric mainline, which isn't. Uh, I think I think. Um, a press officer kind of got a bit of cheap press out of uh, some kind of name change and really the electric main line relates in the same way that laser guided melodies related to the kind of music we were doing and the kind of sounds we wanted to do so um, I think pure phase I think I mean the, the the phase also relates to the effect of phasing which um, the whole album is shot through but shot through with but not in a kind of obvious way Jason, you seem to have sort of like classic influences. I mean, you know, the Velvets, um, the Stooges, Brian Wilson, um, the Birds. You know, what else kind of sort of goes into the, um, the sort of mixing pot as far as um, you and the band are concerned? I think every, every kind of music. I mean, I've listened to everything from psychedelia through some classicals, through a lot of soul, a lot of R&B. And I think, um, I think, Spiritualized don't buy into genres. We're not kind of, um, we don't kind of limit ourselves by saying, you know, we're only into ambient music or, and I think people that do do that end up with a record collection that has 80% filler. You know, I think, um, I think we just try and buy into the, the, the cream of all good music. Do you kind of sort of check what other people are sort of up to? I mean, you know, who do you think of as like your kind of contemporaries? I think, um, not in that way, because I think a lot of music is fashion orientated in the way that maybe people get embarrassed about what they were wearing five years ago in a kind of, and, and maybe the music also um, follows in that way. I think this, there are, I think Stereo Lab are a band that are doing stuff that is completely of themselves, and, and uh, uh, I think that's that, that they kind of work along some of the similar similar kind of things we work around, but come out with something that is considerably different, you know. I think now everybody in the band, all five of us, are very focused on this kind of music we want to do. And by having that, we've got a kind of, almost a kind of jazz feel to it, but without the kind of connotations that jazz implies, without Don't that kind of, and yeah, like and kind of like applauding, you know, people's solos and, you know, eye contact and all that kind of, you know, everybody's, everybody's looking at the drummer or whatever. Without any of that, I think we've got a kind of, um, uh, We've, we've managed to put something new into Spiritualize that, that I don't think we thought we were going to be doing a year ago. Whoa. 